I'm going to introduce you to a new family of rubber baits. It's the McRubber Shad family. It's a series of three sizes for the pikes and one size for the perch or bass. The pike sizes are 29 centimeters and 23 centimeters and 17 centimeters. They are super easy rigged and have a, a much more erratic action if you compare them to the classic McRubbers. Uh, here are the classic McRubbers. They are much wider than these ones. So these are classic shad shapes. Now I'm going to show you how to rig these the easiest way. This is how I rig the 29 centimeter version. All right. So to rig a 23 centimeter version, you need some of the new developed Schwarzanker Stinger tackle. They come in two, in three sizes. One size with one O hooks, one with two O hooks, and one with three O hooks. So small, medium, and large. Or junior, medium, and big, or whatever you'd like to call them. This is the medium size for the 23 centimeter shell. Get a screw, a wire system that is 1.1 millimeter stainless steel, and two VMC 8650. 2 O hooks. Alright, you take the shallow screw, you put it in the, the hole that I made to center the, the screw or the jig head or the screw in head. Super easy. And you screw them in. And you hear the birds. It's so lovely in the springtime in the Swedish archipelago. Mmm, pikeish. All right. And you have the stingers. Whoops. The spike. Droop. And boom. You got a pike rig that is very durable. Very good, and it holds up really good. And when you rig the bait like this, it's very important that you have it in the straight line underneath. Otherwise, the bait will wander really weird or accurate, not so accurate. With this kind of rigging, you will have it very accurate. Okay, and then we have another thing that we developed. It's the weighted dots. It's sink weights and they come from one and a half gram, three grams, four grams, six grams and ten grams. So they are lead free, made out of sink. And they are super easy to, to, uh, to make your own kind of sinking depth or swimming action on the, on the lures. The cool feature about these ones is that first of all you have a, a slot there. Can you see the slot in the middle? The slot? That's made for a special kind of thing. You take the, the screw in dot, put it in the center of the bait, like this, and you just screw it in there. I mean, you can put them anywhere, but I think the center is a good place because then it gives a little bit more swimming action to the bait. There you go, like that. And then you see the wiring here. It's 
super good, super easy. Like that. And here you got a Dumbledee pike hunting machine. <laughs> okay, that was the McRubber Shack.